your religion. G'day guys, welcome back to Life Story Recovery. Today I am down on Bondi Beach on the south end and I'm here with Rob. Now Rob has unfortunately lost not his wedding band, but actually his fiance's engagement ring. So guys, I think he's gonna be in the doghouse over this one. His fiance is gonna be loving and supporting. Rob, how did you actually lose your fiance's engagement ring today? I was looking after it for her, because she was body surfing yeah. with my son Bobby. Um, I thought it was tied around my loop in my pocket. I pulled it out because I was worried it was gonna get scratched. It literally slipped through my fingers, landed in the in the sand. Straight in the sand. Gone. Gone. Like that. So were you out in the water or were how far? No, I was stood in the, in the wash. In the, in the wash. wash. Just, just here, yeah, just here. Oh, okay, just, just in here. the tide line. Roughly about ankle deep. Ankle deep. Ankle deep, ankle yeah. deep water. The water coming waves, in, yeah, coming yeah, a lot of waves. Yeah. More than now, yeah, yeah, yeah. What do you think my chances are of actually finding your ring today? Before I spoke to you, probably say zero, uh, yeah. because of the, the, the amount of water that's moving around. Yeah, and, there's a lot of movement. Yeah, and the sand. But after speaking to you on the on the phone and yeah. asking me a few, uh, well, you asked me a few questions, a few yeah, points, um, details, guys. You need the details. Um, a few key questions, and yeah. from your reply, I'm feeling, I, I have a hope. I'm pretty confident. Yeah. Yeah. Pretty confident. Pretty confident. Yeah. You need as much details as possible, and it's the owners who are actually finding these rings, guys. I'm just a guy from metal detector, you know. They put me in the right search area. And I'm gonna find it. All right, guys. So what we're gonna do now? We're gonna mark up the grid line. It's basically right here in front of us, about 10 square metres across. Yeah, not even. Look, in line with that sign. In line with the drain here. Yeah. And the, the drain's straight ahead. Higher. Yeah, probably bang, right yeah. there. I'd say. All right, perfect. Say. It's just strictly behind us there, on the left hand and right hand side. That shouldn't be too high. Angle deep water, guys, but you've got to remember, if the wave does catch the ring on the side, it can actually roll a few metres, but we're hoping not. But we've got the area. I'll search in the water if I have to, but we'll see how we go. All right, guys, I'll see you out there. Cheers. <laughs> I'm too sexy for my love. Too sexy for my love. Love's going to leave. Did you hear a lady lost the ring this morning? We're here looking for Rob's engagement ring. I've got a good tone, not too sure if it is it. It could be a bit of tin. All right, guys, let's dig it. <laughs> Boys. Name of the truth? Maybe. Is that it? Check it out guys! <laughs> you are <Dick>. rich. <laughs> Alright Rob, I'll let you take the honours. Uh, and the last time I... <laughs> Check it out guys! Oh! That was That's so beautiful! Cool. <laughs> oh, there you go, there you go. Yeah. Check that out guys! So what kind of ring is that? It's a Ceylon... Uh, Sapphire. Like sapphire, two diamonds on the side, two 18 carat black gold. Yeah. <laughs> We're going to tell you, he did not go cheap on that ring, guys. That is beautiful. Rob, that is beautiful. All right. Can I shake you by the hand? Yeah. <laughs> you are Check it legend. out, guys. No, that's absolutely <laughs> awesome. Beautiful Bondi Beach. Check it out, guys. <laughs> that's so good. We found Look it, guys. <laughs> Check it out. That is, what is it exactly? Uh, a Ceylon uh, Sapphire. A Ceylon. Uh, Ceylon? Ceylon? Um, sapphire. <laughs> I can't tell you what carrot, but it's pretty big. Diamonds on the shoulders. Two diamonds on the outside. White gold. 18 carat. Absolutely. 18 like carat. 
my yeah. favourite thing in the world. <laughs> Number one, guys, that's it. You don't go cheap. This guy's a legend. <laughs> Absolute legend. Check it out. So, I, nev I never thought it. Yeah, you didn't think. No, nah, no. Nah. I hope. Yeah, hope. Yeah, exactly. That's what. That's all you can do, guys. It's just hope for the best. But you know, if you lose the ring, you know, if you can put me in the right search area, I can't guarantee, but I guarantee it. I'll find it for you. How long have you been engaged for? So we've been engaged for uh, uh, New Year's Eve 2016. So just over a year. Just over a year. Oh, yeah. Okay. And we're getting married in eight weeks. Eight weeks. So. So this was very important. But incredibly important. Yes, most I can't definitely. Explain how important it was. Yeah. We, we've got it. <laughs> I'm not letting go of it. Definitely. I'm not letting go of it. So everybody, <laughs> reckon, guys, Rob won't be sleeping in the doghouse tonight. He'll be sleeping nice and cozy in bed. With your misses. Hope so. Well, definitely. Awesome. <laughs> Most definitely. How long do you think I took today? Wow, I reckon from when you put the markers in. Yeah, the markers. You would have been. You went one way. Yeah, and one then way. You moved it a meter this way. Yeah, three foot across. And then across. you came the oh, halfway back. Oh, I can't remember what you said, but you said. Yeah. May, I, I think oh, this like, could maybe, be it. Guys. Pretty, maybe, yeah. Yeah. Bang. <laughs> I reckon not even ten minutes. Not even not ten even minutes. Ten minutes, and that was. <laughs> I lost that at half past nine, so that's, how long ago is that? That's like four, nearly four hours ago. Three yeah. and a half, four hours ago. There you go, guys. So that, that's actually proof for you as well. This was actually dropped on the tide line. Rob can verify that. Dropped straight at his feet. A wave came, smashed the ring. Now, a lot of you guys who don't do metal detecting, who are watching my channel, if you think a wave is gonna take that ring and drag it out to New Zealand. Look at it. This is a once in a lifetime opportunity, man. Just let me go out there. Let me get one wave before you take me. One wave. Now where am I going to go, man? Cliffs on both sides. I'm not going to paddle in New Zealand. If it catches it on the corner, it will roll a couple of meters. As soon as it finds a nice little spot, it's going to bury down. That's all that's going to happen. So it's been from 9 o'clock. We're out here now. It's around 1 o'clock. So it's about three, four hours that it's been lost for. And it was sitting, do you reckon, sitting in the same location? Bang on. I reckon it's moved two meters at the most. Exactly. And we, we were searching for two hours. Yeah, Got two all. hours, hands and knees. All the people on the beach were like, what have you lost? What have you lost? Yeah. So we're in there, we're looking. <laughs> and, and bang, you found yeah. it like that. That's how it is, guys, as well. When you're digging around, hands and knees, even in the wet sand, when you actually grab a handful of sand and it goes through water, the ring will actually slip through your fingers and you wouldn't even realize it's there, guys. That's how tricky these things are. So always, yeah, metal detecting is the best way to go. Yeah. I've been, we've been looking <laughs> for hours thinking yeah. it's lost. It's gone, it's yeah. in New Zealand or whatever. Mine like metal detectors, they'll always get it for you. After finding that, I'm still shaking. I was shaking like a leaf. Yeah, oh, me too. I shaking like, like a leaf during. when you, did you yeah. see me, I was face Yeah, I know, I'm just like, I was just like, far out, I yeah. can't believe it. All right, so that's it for today. Rob, good to meet you, mate. Top Fabulous load. to meet you. Yeah, Fabulous. awesome. All right, guys, until next time, share, like, subscribe, and I'll see you on the next hunt. Happy hunting, guys. Cheers. Ha <laughs> ha.